Hi everyone, I needed some last minute holiday cards and I decided to do my 10 cards with my December card kit. So I hope you guys enjoy and here we go. For card number one, I'm going to do some watercoloring using this um, image that came in the card kit. And then do some fussy cutting on the top and the bottom and then put the card together. I want it to look like the reindeer is actually standing behind a snowbank and then I'm going to add um, a couple stickers from the kit and as you can see I add the snowflake paper on the top framed it with some red um, pattern paper and that's it. Card number two, Santa is going to be caught in a snowstorm. So I started with this blue piece of cardstock and I'm adding a little color to it using uh, my tumble tumbled glass distress ink. And I'm going to add this huge sticker from the kit. And um, this sticker also said, Here comes Santa. And add a little sticker in the corner. And then I'm going to use an ink pad that came in the kit that I'm going to create my snowstorm with and as you can see I'm using Simon Says white ink and then this one is very simple just add it to a red card base and that's it for card number three I use the Santa image and I'm cutting him with using my Copic markers and I'm also going to fussy cut him out. Then I added some stripe, piece of stripe paper from the kit and some Hero Arts glitter paper to the bottom of this green card base and then as you can see I use some green, I believe that's peel paint distress ink and stamp it some snowflakes at the top, add my Santa and the sticker that says they're Santa, define good and that's it for card number three. For card number four, I started with a piece of watercolor cardstock and the Crafter's Companion glitter pen. And I'm adding some color using this blue one. And I cut it down, add my Santa sticker to it, use the stripe paper as my background. And that was simple card number four. Card number five is also a simple one. I started with that snowy piece of blue cardstock and I cut out that Santa image from one of the pattern papers. And I'm just gonna add my North Pole sign. It's also a sticker from the kit. And added that to a card base and that's it for card number five. For 
card number six I started with this piece of a piece of pattern paper from the kit and I'm using the hero arts glitter paper again to cut some strips to add between all the sections of this piece of pattern paper and I ended up not using the entire thing I actually cut off the little small areas at both ends and put in the card together just using the centerpiece and adding it to a red card base. Card number seven, I started with the Try Window Cover die from Mama Elephant. And I used this red snowflake piece of pattern paper to cut it out. And I'm just going to use it as a frame for my little reindeer, the Santa, and the Christmas tree sticker. And this would be it for card number seven. Card number seven, I started some coloring with using my tumbled glass distress ink. Just to add some color in the background. I also colored another center image, and I'm going to put the card together just using images from the stamp set and the center that I also fussy cut out. For card number nine, I used this piece of pattern paper in the kit, and I cut a section from it from the, cent the section from the center of the piece of cardstock, and I created a scene that looked like the North Pole. At first, I was going to use that huge sticker house, then I changed that and cut out a bunch of small Christmas trees from one of the pattern papers, and kind of. And glue them to the center of that snowy section at the North Pole. And that's it for card number nine. Finally, for card number 10, I started with this blue paper from the kit. Created a snow bank using one lawn fawn die. And as you can see, I'm also using a pretty die from Mulan Fawn. And I want it to look like um, snow, snow snickles or icicles above 
my scene and I just cut it in white and add it to my card and then I'm using this pretty reindeer from the kit is one of the stickers he's too cute and I'm just gonna add him to the front like so and then also cut the sentiment from one of the pattern papers and it says Merry Christmas and that's it for card number 10 I also made two bonus cards um, which I didn't show the process for them as you can see and that's pretty much it for my cards these are the 10 cards I made well 12 and that's it for me and I hope you guys enjoy your holiday and Merry Christmas to everyone and I'll see you guys in the next video